Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are here playing another game battle and we are facing at his 2 and 2, but he doesn't have that impressive of GB ranks or anything. So I don't know how good he's going to be, but um yeah, we are here facing this guy. We're playing Hunted Search and Destroy GB variant settings and I sorry if you guys hear a slight bit of background in this video. Um I hope it's not too much. You guys probably wouldn't even notice if it was uh if I didn't say anything, but I hope you guys don't uh, hear any because there's just times where I go quiet in the video you guys might hear some background so I just wanted to say that um, but yeah we are going to go ahead and run a Vesper um, overkill M8 I see people going around saying people that run Vesper M8 overkills are bad I don't understand why though it's a good strategy if you have long range and you have really close range Ah, what just happened? I should have. I think I should have won that gunfight. I don't know what you guys think. I, I I know I didn't hit all the hits the shots, but okay. This guy likes to run that. Um, this guy likes to run what's her name grenades. Um, okay, so this guy doesn't know what he's doing. I didn't check what um Pablo he was before this. Um, what prestige and stuff he is. But all right, this guy knows what he's doing. He you know, I kind of had some shaky aim right there at the beginning of the round. I haven't played today really. I've played um. I probably played two two matches overall, and that's basically it. So I haven't really played today, and I ha I didn't play yesterday. I've had some. All right, so this guy likes to stun and give away his positions slightly. We flank. I think we're gonna just go ahead and play this flank. Let's go. Lights are so good in this game because I did not see him if he didn't have lights. All right. I, I was questioning whether I should have won and planted A or go right there. All right, so we won that. Gunfight. I actually want to make sure this guy uses his uh, stuns because if he's using stun. Oh, this guy know how to G slide too. That's also what I wanted to say. I feel like the base count is slightly off because I go, I lean in when I'm in battle or when I'm playing because I use my uh, knees as like a, as a rest, resting tool, I guess. I don't really know what to say, but I use it to rest my uh, hands on. I lean in. We didn't see him jump. I don't think we did at least. Okay, he went A. Hmm. This guy likes to play A a lot, I see. Ah, man. Laz, so this guy likes to do loops. Okay. We, we've we we've been learning stuff. I, I knew, I thought he was going to be in the back of spawn. At least I don't, I didn't know he was going to be in the back of spawn. That was bad timing. I thought, I mean, if, no, if people do a loop like that, normally they're going to jump balcony right away. They're not going to look back at that truck, but it was a, a good look by him. That time for me to have my MA out because I think I definitely would have won that with uh, Vesper. We're gonna go mid this time. We're gonna look over mid for a second because I don't think this guy goes mid. I think this guy hits bombs. And yeah, this guy isn't as uh, as bad as I thought he was. Uh, I, he didn't really have much in his GB. His GB stats stats didn't show much. So I didn't really know. kind of bad to go into games where your opponent doesn't have anything to show in their GB stats. Have a super clean, squeaky clean, cleaner than my room record. I honestly think this is a good spot. Just because you're watching the back and mid. This might actually be, I just found this out, but this might actually be a good spot if you like lay right here. Oops, I'm about to jump into the window. Alright, if we actually do get this down, we're gonna go ahead and do a loop from balcony.
Let's go. Obvious loop. After I didn't see him on bomb, it was an obvious loop. And he wasn't ADSing, so it kind of messed him up. Okay, so this guy is better. I think we're about the same level. We're leveled with each other, so that's going to definitely help him. And I don't know why I start these episodes without putting Carmex on or something. Chapstick, whatever you guys like calling it, but my chips are chips. My lips. <laughs> my lips are uh, dry. Oops, and I hit the G side. Hope this guy isn't off to a super amazing start. Let's go. This guy favorites a bomb like so much that I figured he was gonna go with that round. Where was he last? I, he must have been B last round. All right, good. We took the lead. Uh, I have a feeling I want to go Razorback. Honestly, um, Razorback is like an AR sub if you ask me, and it's like really good for AR, but it's really good for subs at the same time. I just had a little belch there, excuse me. I think I'm gonna have a hard time syncing up this audio and face, or uh, gameplay. I mean, yeah, I'm syncing up the audio to the game. I don't know what to say. Because I'm like commenting on stuff super late. Like I just had a belch and then I commented on it like five seconds late. Woo! If you guys saw that in the webcam, I just jumped right there. I saw the bullet go right past me and I was just like, whoa. I don't think I saw anything. Honestly, that guy has so much more room that it kind of surprises me that he actually went for that snipe. Like, he, I mean, not room, he had more time. my gosh, I'm jumping so... You guys do not know how much I'm jumping. Like, I just saw him right there when he shot, and I just jumped. Like, I've never, like, jump Like, a scare jump, like you're scared of something. I've never had that type of jump while playing Call of Duty, but I don't know why, but today it's just like I'm going, like... I don't know. I'm gonna have to look back in the game, see if I'm, uh... If I am actually doing so. All right. So we're gonna use um, our nade class this round, our uh, v Vesper nade. Too predictable of a play, my friend. Like. I don't, I don't see people really normally challenge it from the same area. Like, that guy challenged it, like, challenged it three times from Ridge. Plus, I had Heat Wave. Okay, so we have Heat Wave this game, this round. This guy has to win four rounds to win. I have to win one. So, keep that in mind, and we probably have a win here. See, I is better than I thought he was, but we've had some lucky, lucky, um, rounds, and we've had some some rounds that he just made big mistakes on like la the the round where I was using Razorback that was a lucky round because I don't I think he should have gotten the kill I just don't think his accuracy was very good I threw a nade on. I threw a distraction nade on that side of the map, so I don't know if this guy is gonna go to B bomb and check it. Bomb Do a stun. It means he's not on bomb, so that gives me about to twenty five. Let's go, easy win. All right, 
easy win that round. I I had jumped about five times that game. If you guys could find all five or four times I jumped in that video, I will give you a free pair of control freaks. I don't know. No, that's probably not going to be it. But I hope you guys all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like. That was another win for us. Oh, I have a cookie. I forgot. I put a few cookies in my pocket earlier. <laughs> Girls sell cookies. Anyways, uh, <laughs> I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like. I will see you guys all in the next video. Peace out, guys.